What's up, friends? It's Sergio with BustingPacks.com and SportsCardAlbum.com. Really excited to bust a box of Top 75th Anniversary uh, this New Year's Day. So this is a super, super awesome product. Um, hasn't gotten a ton of attention. Not a lot of people uh, have been talking about it. Uh, you can see some nice box breaks of the stuff in the Blowout Cards non-sports forum. But... Uh, this is one of the few non-sport products that I am stoked about. I mean, you get uh, four hits per box, including three autographs and one authentic buyback card. Now, when I'm telling you autographs and buyback cards, I'm talking there are buyback cards that uh, you know from Rocky, Rocky card trading card sets that were made in the '80s with his Sylvester Stallone's autograph, uh, Rambo. Um, James Bond, all sorts of James Bond cards with autographs, Elizabeth Taylor, Roger Moore, uh, there are Seinfeld cards in here, Garbage Pail cards in here, there are rare Garbage Pail Kids cards that are selling for $500 on eBay, so this set, wow, look at this, 3D Tarzan and the She-Devil, very, very cool, very cool, I mean, so the set just, uh, the set itself, <laughs> I'm not going to be able to focus on that because it's, uh, let's see if I can, there we go. Yeah, cool 3D card. Cool historical cowboys and Indians type of card there. All right, so all sorts of different stuff in the base set. Here's a chrome. They've got chrome cards uh, from old school sets. Here's going to be my first autograph right in the first pack. Uh, they got chrome garbage pail kids and everything. So here's a card from Wings. Chrome C125 Raiders. Here's my first autograph, Teenager Sarah Henderson, Ma Maggie Landrick, La Langrick. what the heck is that from? Oh, that's from Harry and the Hendersons, I remember that, that movie. So, random kind of stuff, you know, this autograph isn't going to sell for a million dollars, but it's okay because I'm not selling it anyway, um, but uh, we can find a nice Harry and the Hendersons uh, collector and hook them up, oh, there he is, there's Harry, I remember that guy, I remember that, uh, I just when it was a TV show. Uh, so really cool stuff. Oh, look at that Terminator. Imagine getting a Schwarzenegger or a Harrison Ford autograph, removing the idol. So all these different sets are celebrated. Basically, it's a celebration of all the sets that Topps has created from Pee Wee's Playhouse to Bazooka Joe. So I... <laughs> I love Bazooka Joe. I still chew Bazooka gum every once in a while. I go to Sam's Club and they got a big bucket and I still read through all those cartoons. Uh, so all sorts of cool stuff. This is a set that's going to be fun to just look through the different cards after I'm done. Jeff. Uh, I have no idea what the heck that is. Ugly Stickers Set. So that comes from the Ugly Stickers Set, non-sports universe. Uh, very cool. Chrome card. Midnight Raid. The X-Files, I forgot they made a set about Mulder and Scully. And there's Pee-wee's Playhouse, which I'm not embarrassed to tell you, I was a huge fan of when I was a little boy. Love Pee-wee's Playhouse. I like to draw the talking couch and all that stuff. Alright, I'll go through a little bit faster, but I, I want to make sure I do the set justice. <clears throat> Evil Wheelie. Evil Knievel there on blue chrome. Not numbered. World smelliest feet. Stinky Sandy. You're out of this world. See back. From the monster greeting cards. 50 card set. Oh, cool. So you got uh, even. Uh, oops. Even the Brady Bunch is in this. I guess Tops even made a set commemorating the Brady Bunch back in the day. And there's Superman. So the vast majority of these cards are going to have autograph parallels. A lot of these sets, uh, the, the checklist is just ridiculous for the autographs. And I've seen so many really cool ones pop up from movies that I love, like Rocky, like Rambo. There's Jaws 2, there's Robocop, there's Martin Van Buren, Chrome, from a presidential set. Alright, let's see. Oh, look at that. There you got uh, Freddy Krueger, right? Alright, let's flip through the rest of this a little bit quicker. 
Batman and Robin with the Riddler. Awesome. Jaws 2, Chrome. Donkey Kong would love a Nintendo set. That's awesome. Would love a Nintendo type of autograph. This is going to be like comic book reading. I'm going to bring a, set, uh, a stack of these to the bathroom with me and just read through them. I'm just kidding. Any cards I give away, I promise I will not bring to the bathroom with me. Robocop Chrome. John Lennon. That would have been a cool autograph to get. Green Hornet. I don't think they're going to be getting me any Bruce Lee autographs. Sad to say. Humongous Bruce Lee fan. Ghostbusters. Wow. Alright, cool. That Batman card that I enjoyed. Batman and Robin. I grew up loving this show. In Chrome. Poor little Gizmo. Here's Johnny Travolta. And the Peacemakers. Still have uh, three hits to go. Evil Knievel. You got Alf. Oh, sweet. Bart Simpson TV, uh, TV said this is a card from the late 80s after it just came out. And there is a Garbage Pail Kids Atom Bomb. So this is one of the cards that uh, the one of one version of this sold for almost $600. So there are parallel versions of these cards. And uh, they go for crazy money. Garbage Pail Kids, a very famous set. Oh, cool. He-Man. Another thing that I grew up with. I loved collecting all the toys when I was a kid. Kung Fu. David Kerrigan. Kung Fu, a lot of people don't know that Bruce Lee actually came up with the idea for Kung Fu. And I just got an autograph that I'm in love with. Rocky IV, my favorite of all the Rockies. Burt Young autograph. Polly. Hated Polly. I hated the character. He was such a jerk. But... By the end, you, you really fall in love with him, um, and especially in Rocky Balboa, which I love. I, I always consider Rocky Balboa the final movie in the set. Rocky V, to me, never actually happened. And if you talk to uh, Sylvester Stallone, he'll tell you the same thing, that forget Rocky V ever happened, and the real ending of Rocky is Rocky Balboa, which is a beautiful movie. <clears throat> All right, I'm really excited about that autograph, Burt Young autograph that you got. There you got, hey, the Fonz, Fonzarelli. A lot of packs, a lot of fun, a lot of nostalgia. Bust this with a friend, bust this with a parent. New kids on the block, uh, yeah, whatever. Grease, Sandy, and this, boy, I remember that movie kind of freaked me out when I was a little boy. Joker, his sidekick. That was a scary movie. Jack Nicholson. For a little kid, that was really dark. Moonraker. Oh, man. Jaws. Love that movie. There's a chrome version of that thing. Sighting the Death Star. Star Wars set. Man, that'd be cool to get a Star Wars autograph. I'm hoping for a Sylvester Stallone auto. Ooh, here's like a shiny chrome card. Davey senses trouble. Numbered out of 75. Davy Crockett. That one's serial numbered. Four out of 75. Davy Crockett. Set that aside. Jurassic Park. A little fencing card. I don't know where that's from. Possibly Bazooka Joe. <laughs> you never touch him. Oh, his head's coming off. Michael Jackson. Another 3D card, not numbered. This man, this monster, Incredible Hulk. Green. Oh man, that would be cool to get that one as a parallel card. It is not. We're at the nine minute mark on this video. I'm trying to speed it up, but I'm just enjoying this too much. Here's my next autograph. Ed Gale from something I'm not sure, some duck show. Duck you sucker. <laughs> duck you. Howard the Duck. That's right. Lucasfilm comedy from 86. With lines like duck you, I probably wasn't allowed to watch it as a little boy or something. But there's my autograph. 
Ed Gale, duck you, sucker. Still one more hit to go. I'll try to get to this one a little bit faster. I will do as I typically do, bust all these packs open. There's Elvis Presley base card in there. Real nice wax packs the tops put together for this as well. And the cool thing is that the parallels, like I said, sell for really nice money if you're into that sort of thing, but they're very collectible and people that were buying this set really liking uh, the different sets. All the parallels of the Garbage Kit Pail Kids are in demand. Um, all of the parallels of the Simpsons cards and really all the different games and uh, or all the different TV shows and movies and everything commemorated in this set have big fan bases. So it's not a surprise that this set is quite popular. <clears throat> Let's see what we get. Any serial numbered cards? Electrifying performance. Garbage Pill Kids. Atom Bomb. He Man. Buffalo Bill. James Dean. Not numbered. Ghostbusters. Elizabeth Taylor. Ooh, Ninja Turtles. Yeah, baby. Ninja Turtles. Beautiful card from the original animated series. That's my childhood right there in a nutshell. Still supposed to get one more hit, Donkey Kong. Oh, cool. Gadzooka. Not numbered. Bart Simpson. JFK, I love you forever guy, not numbered. I wonder what the hit's going to be. And we either missed it or I read the box wrong or let's see. Four hits per box. Guaranteed three celebrity autographs and one authentic buyback card. Oh, that's right. I must have missed it. One of these cards is an original buyback card. So I'm going to have to go through all these cards on the back and see which one is an authentic card from way back when. So I'm going to do that myself and look through which card doesn't have a 2013 on the bottom. That'll probably just have a sticker saying that it was purchased back by Topps. Uh, Alright, well let's see if I can find it really fast. Otherwise I'll just post what card it was in the description and I'll link to it in the blog article on bustingpacks.com. I'll put an image of it. Holy crap! Good Times card, three out of 10. I didn't see that. Whoa. I don't understand, this isn't even like uh, refracted or anything, but this is number three out of 10. All in the family, wow. That is cool, wow, that's three out of 10. So it's worthwhile to look through all these cards on the back See if you missed anything. Elvis Presley. This is exciting to see what my original buyback card is. But, um, oh, let's, now nah, you know what, it's already freaking a 14 minute video. Gonna do, wait for one more minute. Alright, no, 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 no. Nah, this is gonna take too long. I don't wanna bore you guys. So, uh, check out the description. I'll tell you what it is. I'll put a link in the blog post to what the card is. And, um, Keep coming back to BustingPacks.com and SportsCardAlbum.com uh, for all of your blogging and sports card organizing needs. Wait, is this it? Yeah, this is probably it. All Hell Breaks Loose, Batman Returns. No, well, I mean, it's got the top 75 on it, but it doesn't actually have a 2013 on the bottom. 1992. This is the first card I've seen that does not have a 2013 on it, so I'm guessing this is my buyback card. We shall see. Thanks, guys.